At the moment, everything is going right for the Marquette men's soccer team. After defeating the number 23 ranked West Virginia Mountaineers on Saturday night by the score of 2-1, the Golden Eagles have now taken down three top 25 teams in a row. The historic season continues for Marquette, as this is the first time in program history that they've started a conference campaign 5-0-0. No, I was really happy about the overall performance, I really was. We had some issues that we needed to think on our feet and we did it. I mean, it was fantastic today. What a great game of uh, soccer. Dennis Halawadi opened the scoring with this 28th minute header. After the game, Coach Louis Bennett commended all of his back line. Dennis Halawadi and Paul Dillon really worked well today. Um, but, you know, Pothis and, Pothis and Alfano were fantastic. Alfano is probably one of Alfano's best game of the season. He had a couple of, he had a diving header, he, he chased a couple of guys down, uh, and Pothis was Pothis, you know, it's, uh, he's, uh, it's a statement when you say Pothis, it's reliability. Then, with under 15 minutes left to play, freshman Sebastian Jansen scored his second game winner in as many games. Uh, Kelman got the ball from, I think it was from C, and I know Kelman is good, I knew he was going to beat his guy. And I mean, I saw the cross was going to come in, and when the cross comes, you have to get to the ball. Sebastian's dad and little brother have been at the last two Golden Eagles games, but he says that winning is enough motivation for him. Honestly, I'm proud to be playing good in front of my dad and my little brother, but I mean, I want to win. That, that's what motivates me. I want to go to the Big East Championship, and I want to go to the NCAA Championship. That's the reason why I came to America, because I wanted to win stuff, because I like winning. The Golden Eagles will look to maintain their undefeated start to the conference season on Wednesday night as they host the nationally ranked Georgetown Hoyas. Reporting from Valley Fields, Matt Treby, MUTV Sports.